All right, welcome back. It's your boy Jay, aka the Murder Whistle. If you're looking for my co-pilots, right here. Today, when this hit YouTube, this will be the start of my birthday week. This week, I picked all movies that I wanted to watch. So today, we're watching Shutter Island. I know Leo, I think your boy who played the Hulk, is the stars of this one. This is one of the movies that my mom liked. She said it was a really good one. I've had other people tell me it was good. So, I decided to watch it for my birthday week. This is one of those ones that I never would have watched if it wasn't for this channel. Because it's like 2 hours and 18 minutes. I mean, I know y'all probably don't think that's long, but I hell, I don't think it's long now, but Back when I went to watch movies like that, that's a marathon. That's we're not doing it. <laughs> but um, I'm super excited to get into it. Some of y'all may notice that the beard. Is... I will try to keep it for longer, like a little bit longer. So I was trying to keep it, but you know what I'm I just I couldn't have it. I couldn't. It had to be done. But. Anyway, like I said, I'm excited to get into this, but before we do it, need y'all do me a favor. I need y'all hit the thing thing, the like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to check us out on Patreon. Over there, you get early access to my full lengths. Um, you get exclusives, and you get a po uh, weekly poll you can vote on to help decide what I watch on Fridays. Don't forget to check us out on social media. Don't forget to check out the merch store. We got some new stuff over there. With all that being said, I'm ready to get into this. So I'll see you on the other side. Let's get it. Ain't that how the dinosaur song used to go? He's seasick. You okay, boss? Yeah, I'm fine. I just, uh, I just can't, can't stomach the water. You're my new partner. That's right. Well, they do partners. What about you? You got a girl? Babe? I was. Dang, his woman, she too old. Give you a briefing about the institution before you left. All I know is it's a mental hospital for the criminally insane. <laughs> a mental hospital for the criminally insane. So they going to Arkham. We'll be casting off as soon as you two are ashore. I'd appreciate it if you'd hurry up about it. Why? Storm's coming. Yeah, I don't want to be on the water when the storm comes. I ain't gonna lie to you. I don't care how big the boat is. Never seen a marshal's badge before. Welcome to Shutter Island. I'll be the one taking you up to Ashcliff. Oh, These motherfuckers are strapped, ain't they? Boys seem a little on edge, Mr. McPherson. Right now, Marshal, we all are. Man, them had them things ready, didn't they? Electrified perimeter. How can you tell? I've seen something like it before. Yeah, they definitely at Arkham. <laughs> you know, Gotham in Detroit. You are hereby required to surrender your firearms. We are duly appointed federal marshals. We are required to carry our firearms with us at all times. They about to them. Gentlemen, you will not get through this gate with your firearms. I don't know if I wouldn't go there without my gun. You know what I'm saying? That's terrifying. Marshal Daniels? Doctor. Marshal Orr. What the f What is his name? Thank you, Deputy Warden. That'll be all. Yes, sir. Oh, my God. What is his name? He was the Mandarin. What is his name? McPherson's a good man. He believes in the work we do here. And what would that be exactly? A moral fusion between law and order and clinical care. Oh, what is his name? What the f is that? 
Used to be the kind of patients we deal with here were shackled and left in their own filth. We drove screws into their brains. We submerged them in icy water until they lost consciousness or even drowned. And now? Try to heal, try to cure. If that fails, at least we provide them with a measure of comfort in their lives. These are all violent defenders, right? They've hurt people. Murdered them in some cases. In almost all cases, yes. And personally, Doc, I'd have to say, screw their sense of calm. Man, you little asshole, ain't he? Rachel Solando escaped sometime in the last 24 hours. Huh? Last night. She considered dangerous? You could say that. She killed all three of her children. Shut the f*** up. And what about the husband? He died on the beaches at Normandy. She starved herself when she first came here. She insisted the children weren't dead. Shut the f*** up. To sustain the delusion that her children never died, she's created an elaborate fictional structure and she gives us all parts to play in that fiction. What's more disturbing is we don't know how she got out of her room. Yeah, I'm just I'm just curious because you were saying she escaped. They got all these fences and shit. he said one the one was outside was electric. You gotta buzz in, buzz out. Like how the f she get out? So she left here barefoot. Come on, Doc. She couldn't get ten yards in that terrain. I mean, she from the country. She could. Shut the f up. Who is 67? Fuck if I know. I have to say, that's quite close to my clinical conclusion. <laughs> Doctor, we're going to need access to the personnel files of all the medical staff, anyone who was working there. I'll take your request under consideration. This is not a request, Doctor. Dangerous prisoner. Patient. Patient. Hey, he, he's not he's not he's not bull with that pa um that patient prisoner. We're gonna need to speak with the staff. Do you understand? Or walk away. If you have any further questions, feel free to join the deputy warden in the search. Oh, she might be dead. They ain't even looking for. Current was strong last night. She'd have drowned have been crushed on the rocks, and a body would have washed back up on shore. What about those caves down there? Have you checked them? No way she could get there. The base of those cliffs are covered in the poison ivy. Bruh, if she crazy, she can get there. I'm waiting to tell you. Crazy can do some amazing shit. Anything unusual occur? Mental institution, Marshal. Usual isn't a big part of our day. <laughs> I mean, look. We're going to need to speak with Dr. Sheen. I'm afraid that won't be possible. He left on the ferry this morning. His vacation was already planned. You're in a state of lockdown. A dangerous patient has escaped and you let her primary doctor leave on vacation? <laughs> yeah, that sounds like some bullshit, don't it? Forgive me, gentlemen, my colleague, Dr. Jeremiah Nairi. Who? Quartet for piano and strings in A minor. I like those glasses. You must be quite adept at interrogations. Hmm. Man, he doesn't like he over there. Neither of you has ever walked away from a physical conflict. And you enjoy it, but because retreat isn't something you consider an option. They weren't raised to run, Doc. I mean, he over there reading the f out of Maney. His English really is very good. You hit the consonants a tad hard, though. Yeah, German. Is legal immigration a crime? Oh, I don't know, doctor. You tell us. Hey, Leo, he good to the motherfucker, ain't he? We're going to need those files on Sheehan and the rest of the staff as well. Out of the question. Bullshit out of the question. Bullshit. Who the hell is in charge here anyway, huh? We're taking the ferry back in the morning. Come on, Chuck. He said, we're taking the ferry back. Where are you going? Hey, boss. We're really packing it in. Listen, Rachel Solando didn't slip out of a locked cell barefoot without any help. Maybe in the morning you'll we'll be bluffing. A... I didn't say that. I'm like him. She had to have some help. Ain't no way in hell this woman has got out all this shit by herself. I found a whole stack of these, Teddy. Jesus, are you ever sober anymore? 
killed a lot of people in the war. Oh. Is that why you drink? Are you real? No. What? She's still here. Who? Rachel. She never left. Hey, she bad, though. She's here. You can't leave. Shut the f*** up. I'm not. And I'm so f***ed up right now. But she is. So is he. Who? Who the f*** is he? You have to let me go. <laughs> I can't. Hey man, this is sad as f***. Shut the f*** up. And my man's so dirty, like, where's she? <laughs> oh. I am about to say, this motherfucker doing some Inception shit. We need to interview the patients who were in Rachel's group therapy session. I thought your investigation was finished. It's not like we could take the ferry. So his nightmare helped him out. The old school believes in surgical intervention. Psychosurgery. Like... Procedures like the transorbital lobotomy. Ain't that kind of crazy yourself? And, and which school are you, Doc? I have this radical idea that if you treat a patient with respect, try and understand, you just might reach him. <laughs> Call that. What should be a last resort is becoming a first response. Give them a pill, put them in a corner, and it all goes away. I like him though. He seems like he cares. He might be a lying f but he seems like he cares. The greatest obstacle to her recovery was her refusal to face what she had done. Is, is there a reason you keep referring to your patient in the past tense, Doctor? Shut the f up, he asked me. Look outside, Marshal. Why do you think? The, I don't know that mother have a valid point. Or he just quick on his feet. We disfigured. What? What Can't wait. What? She'd smile at me. She was so sweet. <laughs> but yeah. you could see it in her eyes. She liked to be naked. To suck cock. Dude, I didn't know you was here at the prison. <laughs> well, why was that a big deal? It was obvious. She wanted me to pull out my thing so that she could laugh at it. Hey, his dick must be small, boy. You know that she drowned her own kids? She drowned her kids. You know what? They should be gassed. All of them. The, the, the retards. The killers. You kill your own kid, gas the bitch. Why do we get told in this? I... <laughs> we called a stray for no reason. Do you know a patient named Andrew Latis? Do you? No! No! I want to go back. Come on. Come on. I got him. All right. Get back. You ain't not making crazy people go crazy. Oh, I'll never get out of here. I'm not sure that I should. Why that nurse got that big ass needle? Quite normal. I mean, in comparison to the other patients here. Well, I have my dark days. I suppose everybody does. She, she got to be dangerous because she got that big ass needle right there for her. I think if, if a man beats you and fucks half the women he sees, no one will help you. Axing him isn't the least understandable thing you could do. Oh. She said she asked him, like, like what is wrong with that? Like, so she just told the same exact story the other dude told. Ain't nobody see that? Y'all are trash cops. Security on them. Y'all are trash. Did 
Did you ever meet a patient named Andrew Latus? No. Never heard of her. She was coached. She used practically the same words as Carly and the nurse. She'd been told exactly what to Who's say. Who's Andrew Latus? He asked every one of those patients back there about him. Who is he? The f*** is he right? I don't give a damn about by the book, boss. I just want to know what the hell is going on. Andrew Latus? He was a maintenance man in the apartment building where my wife and I live. Shut the f*** up. He's also a firebug. Andrew Latus lit the match. That caused the fire that killed my wife. Shut the f up. Oh, so he over there trying to solve two crumbs. Latest got away with it and then he disappeared. He burned down a schoolhouse, killed two people, said voices told him to do it. Shut the f up. First he went to prison, then he got transferred here. He burning up babies? But she sent me for water. She said something to you back there, didn't she? No. She wrote it. Shut the f*** up. Why'd you tell that man to run? We gotta get it done. He's turning into fucking characters out here. Yeah, we, yeah, we wouldn't be out there f*** all that. Like, alright. I'm f***ed up. I'm so f***ed up right now. Like, I don't know... I don't know if this is a whodunit or like a horror movie. So what are you really here to do, Ted? I'm going to get the proof and I'm going to blow the lid off this place. You started asking around about Ashcliff and then suddenly they need a U.S. Marshal. There was a patient escape. It was the perfect excuse. No, 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 boss. Luck doesn't work that way. Nah, bruh. Hey. They got an electrified fence around a septic facility. A chief of staff, it ties to the OSS. Everything about this place stinks of government ops. What if they wanted you here? Yeah, bro. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just saying. It sounds like a setup to me. Now they have us both. Here, now. Marshal, are you out here? This is Deputy Ward McPherson. Hey, man, shut the f*** up, man. We're getting off this goddamn island. You and me. Bro, how the f*** you can get off the island? We're on an island in the middle of the ocean during a hurricane. Mm -hmm. They can't just hop a ferry, scoot over to the mainland and wreak havoc. You're quite right. They're far more likely to wreak havoc right here on us. There's 24 human beings. I put all 42 in wards A and B in manual restraints as well. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, they let him hit wrong shit. You said you had no idea what that second line could refer to, correct? Because I believe I just heard you say there are... 24 patients in Ward C, which means there's a total of what, 66 patients at this facility? That is correct, yes. Hey, his math is mathing. Hey. Well, it seems to me Rachel Solando is suggesting that you have a 67th patient, Doctor. <laughs> this is ridiculous. What are they doing here? We're doing our goddamn job. Hey, that boy's math mathing over there. Rachel's been found. She's here. Shut the fuck up. Doing a mark on her. Check her feet. Who are these men? Why are they in my house? Police officers, Rachel. They have a few questions. Her feet clean, though. Well, I mean, I guess they probably gave her a shower. There has been a sighting of a known communist. In this neighborhood? Yes, I'm afraid so. I wonder what that place looked like in her mind. Oh, bro, she can't help you. She don't live where you live. She can't help you. Bro. Hey, why'd she walk on the bone you? I thought of you. Bitch, you don't know me. Don't you know how lonely I've been, Jim? You're dead. I am not Jim. If I was Jim, I would be doing some horrible things to you right now for killing my kids. 
I'm not Jim because you, you, you're not getting choked. I'll at least kick you in the shin. My Jim's dead, so who the fuck are you? Who the fuck are you? Who are you? Who are you? Oh, Rachel Trippin. We found her down by the lighthouse, skipping stones. I'm going to have to ask you to go down into the basement. There's food, cots. It's the safest place to be when the hurricane hits. Brad, did you not just see what happened to me? Marshal, are you having a migraine? I'll be all right. Oh. What's wrong with that? Oh. Take these, Marshal. Hey, bro, don't take shit they give you, bro. I don't, I don't want It'll the stop pills. the pain, Marshal. Take the pills. <sighs> I'm going to need to lie down. Bro, they didn't drug you at least twice. I'm just saying, he came back quick with them aspirins in the little cup. They didn't drug him at least twice. Who is that? Him? That's the ward. It looks like an ex-military prick, huh? You know what? I ain't gonna argue with you on that one. I just don't understand how a hospital got a warden. I just don't get that part. Told y'all, this is Arkham. I'm telling hey, they they was drugged the shit out of him. They gave him the first drugs. He had to dream about his wife in the in the, in the burnt back. You know what I'm saying? Nah, that's not creepy. This is one of what psychological thrillers. You should have saved me. You should have saved all of us. Why should I save you? I don't know you, little girl. I can't save you if I've never seen you before this this hallucination. This dream that he gave me from these aspirin that does crazy. Buddy. Shut the f up. Ladies. Yeah. Is that Casey Jones? I'm pretty. No hard feelings, right? Hey, bro, I know this is a hallucination, you know what I'm saying, from the drugs, but you gotta punch his face off. He got a scar one way. You gotta give him another one. Just give him put a put a put a nice X on his face. Cause I know how much you need it. The clock's ticking, my friend. We're running out of time. <laughs> hey man, hey, listen, that shit gotta stop. That's the second necessary. What the. F Bitch, I will drop kick you right now. I'm dead. The f Why didn't you save me? I tried. Uh, I wanted to, but by the time I got there, it was too late. Oh, this is A. Hey, no. What? A. Hey, I did not expect this to be this. Hey, bro, don't take stuff they give you. Nothing. You still tripping. You still over there on that old wee, boy. You still on that. Latus isn't dead. He isn't gone. They gave you that banana pudding with the gumdrops. You know what I'm saying? You are gone, bruh. You need to find him, Teddy. You need to find him and you kill him dead. That still ain't this woman. She too old. Y'all know he like young ones. She can buy her own drinks. He don't want her. It's goddamn migraine. Backup generators fail. Whole place has gone crazy. What do you want to do? Oh, so all the crazy people out? 
happened? You think that ain't that right. what happened? Nope, nope. Shut the f up. Was that a patient with an axe? Better stake down there. Shut up! We got most of the Bugsies locked down now, but some of them are still loose. Don't try to restrain them yourselves. These fuckers will kill you. you clear? All right, get your asses moving then. Go on. Ain't no way I'm going in there. The Joker's gonna be in there. Harvey Dent. Harley Quinn in there. I'm going. I'm just. Nah, bro. Pack it up. Time to go. <laughs> Pack this shit up, cuz. I can feel him. Woo! Tag, you're in! <laughs> this motherfucker's playing tag. Hey! Hey! Teddy! F***ing tag. And that's so f***ing funny, bro. <laughs> Yeah, bro, this is not how tag is played. Hey, you know he's strong because crazy strong as fuck. He on his ass now. What are you doing? What you mean, what am I doing? The f jumped to my back and was choking me. What the f was your antennas? Give me a hand with him. I'm gonna get him to the infirmary. Ask me what I'm doing. Nigga, I'm whooping ass. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Where where was you at, partner? Oh, that pussy foot around. I'm talking about what are you doing? I wouldn't be doing this. Bro, you better go down there and see Hannibal, bro. Ladies? <laughs> That's pretty damn funny. I want to stick my arm all way in there. Let me see your goddamn face now! What? So you can lie to me more? I was incidental. A way in. George Norris. Who? It's not possible. You can't be here. You don't like it? Who did this to you, George? You did. No. I'm back in here because of you. Get you out of Dedham, huh? Oh, that's the he said he talked to. Been alone much since you got here? I mean, I've been with my partner. You never worked with him before, have you? He's a U.S. Marshal. You've from never the worked with him before, have you? Shut the f up. I know people like I trust this man. And they've already won. That was the main shot. <laughs> They're gonna... <laughs> Take me to the lighthouse. They're gonna cut into my brain. And I'm only here because of you! George, I'm, I'm gonna get you out of here. You're not going to the lighthouse. She's dead. Let her go. Hey, man. This shit took a turn. You wanna uncover the truth? You gotta let her go. I can't. You have to let her go! I can't! I can't! Oh, this motherfucker crazy himself. Then you'll never leave this island. He talking that real shit, though. I don't know if he's crazy or they done drugged him. I don't know what the going on. Hey. God help you. Man, I'm so fed up. Keep going. You belong here. <sighs> Cause the old boy in the cell sounded like he was telling the truth. But what happened to you? What do you mean? Where were you? He's crazy. The only thing in his files, there's no session notes, no incident reports, no photographs, just this. It was weird. Yeah, take a look. I'll look at it later. What's the matter, boss? I'll look it over later, that's all. We don't trust your ass no more. You wanna do. 
I'm going to that lighthouse. I'm gonna find out what the fuck is happening on this island. That's the main shot right there. Like that that is beautiful, all that water and stuff over there. What the hell can I say to you to stop you? Why why would you want to, Chuck? Why? Climbing down there when it's dark is a thin step short of suicide. That's why. Okay. Man, that makes sense. We still don't trust you. What the hell happened back there in those cells, Ted? I'm going on alone. I'm going with you, boss. I said alone. I ain't gonna lie. I will let him go by himself. I knew it wouldn't take long, but I couldn't get to it. The tide was up. Chuck! You surprised he's gone? Shut the f up. Is that Chuck? Shut the f up. Hey, bruh. They say when rats are bad at a sinking ship, you know what I'm saying? Ship, it's sinking. We need to go. Why is there a light flickering in there? I'm Teddy Daniels. I'm a cop. You're the marshal. What is this woman doing in this cave? I want to make sure that what you're holding won't hurt me. I'm going to keep this. If you don't mind. Yeah. <laughs> you can keep it. Just stay over there with it. Rachel Solando. The real one. Shut the f up. Did you kill your children? I never had children. And before I was a patient at Ashcliff, I worked here. People tell the world you're crazy. And all your protests to the contrary just confirm what they're saying. They did it to Dave Chappelle. And she is barefoot. I started asking about these large shipments of sodium amytol and opium-based hallucinogens. I asked about the surgeries, too. They zap the patient with electroshock and go through the eye with an ice pick. That sounds f***ing horrible. The brain controls fear, empathy, sleep, hunger, anger, everything. What if you could control it? The brain? Recreate a man so he doesn't feel pain. You'll get Michael Myers. 50 years from now, People will look back and say, here, this place is where it all began. We tested patients on Shutter Island. I mean, she don't sound crazy at all. You do understand. But she is in a cave. Barefoot. I am prone to migraines, yes. Jesus. You haven't taken any pills, have you? I mean, even aspirin. I tell you. You tell me at least that you've been smoking your own cigarettes. Shut the fuck up. The oil that he did give him, give him cigarettes. Tell me what goes on in that lighthouse. Shut the fuck up. Brain surgery. They learned it from the Nazis kind. Who knows about this? On the island, I mean, who? Everyone. Come on, man. They, they couldn't possibly know about Everyone. This got deep. You can't stay here. I'm afraid if they come looking for you, they might find me. I'm sorry, but you have to go. Ask her how she got out. But I could come get you, get, get you off this island. Haven't you heard a word I've said? The only way off the island is a ferry, and they control it. Shut the fuck up. I had a friend. I was with him yesterday, but we got separated. Marshall, you have no friends. Shut the f up. Her and the dude in the cell been talk. Hey, they been talking like like they ain't crazy. You know what I'm saying? Where have you been? Oh, I'm just wandering. Hey man, I still can't think of this mother name, man. Looking at your island. Oh, I forgot you're leaving. Now that Rachel's been found. 
Apparently, there was an unidentified man in Ward C yesterday. He subdued a highly dangerous patient quite handily. It seems you had a long conversation with a paranoid schizophrenic, George Noyce. He's uh, delusional. Oh, extremely. It can be quite upsetting. Hey, they are looking at him. So you're taking the ferry? Yes, absolutely. I, uh, I think we've gotten all we came here for. So We, Marshal? Speaking of which of you, have you seen him, Doctor? Whom? My partner, Chuck. You don't have a partner, Marshal. You came here alone. Shut the f*** up. They didn't kill Chuck. So tell me again about your partner. What partner? Because Chuck was real. They got Chuck. Marshal. Going somewhere? What's this, Doctor? Huh? Just a sedative. A precaution. Oh, precaution. Man, he's really about to get that m***er, wasn't he? The word trauma comes from the Greek for wound. Wounds can create monsters, and you... You are wounded, Marshal. Hey, they flipping the script on him real nice, ain't they? And wouldn't you agree? When you see a monster, you, you must stop it. Bro, stab him with the needle and go on about your business. Ah! That's what I'm talking about. That's what we're doing. Ah! He was trying to get your ass, bro. And we ain't looking for Chuck. He gone. There's only one place they'd take him. You go there and you'll die. He's my partner. If they are hurting him, if they're holding him against his will, I've got to bring him out. Don't go, Teddy, please. Please don't do this. Don't go. Hey, listen. I mean, why he keep seeing these kids, man? Creepy-ass little girl. I'm, I don't know. How the f*** are you gonna get there? Yeah, that wouldn't have been an option for me. You know how cold that water is? Now it's socks wet. Don't move! Stay where you are! I'm not gonna kill you. What the out that moment? He didn't even try to open it the regular way. Shut the fuck up! Why are you all wet, baby? What did you say? You know exactly what I said. What did you say? The rifle's empty, by the way. Have a seat. Shut the fuck up! Dr. Sheehan came in on the ferry this morning. Huh? You blew up my car. I really love that car. Sorry to hear about that. Why did you have a car on the island anyway? Tremors are getting pretty bad. How are the hallucinations? You don't never leave. This place is going to be the end of you. You can't be showing up right now while I'm here talking to this man. I found a doctor in a cave out by the cliffs, but... Dry stitches? You'll never get to her. I don't doubt it, considering she's not real. What? What the fuck is this? Withdrawal. Withdrawal? Chlorpromazine. The same thing we've been giving you for the past 24 months. For the past two years, you, you, you've had somebody slipping me drugs in Boston. Is, is that it? Here. everything I've seen here, Doctor. What? You really think you're gonna convince me I'm crazy, huh? 
Do you know the kind of people that I deal with every day? I'm a U.S. Marshal. Hey, they good. They, they good, ain't they? Where's Chuck? Where is he? Let's try this another way. Notice anything these four names have in common. It's your rule of four. Andrew, what do you see? If you've done anything to my partner, Doctor, that is a violation of... Focus, Andrew, what do you see? What do we see? Have the same letters. Edward Daniels has exactly the same 13 letters as Andrew Ladis. The names are anagrams for each other. Yeah, yeah, tactics. <laughs> They're not gonna work on you. You came here for the truth. Here it is. Your name is Andrew Ladis. The 67th patient at Ashcliffe is you, Andrew. Bullshit. You were committed here by court order 24 months ago. Shut the f up! Your crime is terrible. One you can't forgive yourself for, so you invented another self. Get down to the facts. You've created right. a story in which you're not a murderer. He lying, ain't he? He's lying. Andrew. My name is Edward Daniels. I've been hearing this fantasy for two years now. I know every detail. I wish I could let you just live in your fantasy world. Hey, hey. But you're violent, trained, dangerous. You're the most dangerous patient we have. Hey, he's lying, though, ain't he? It's two weeks ago, you attacked George Noyce. Old girl said, hey, old girl in the cave said they was going to get you. Give me one reason why I would even touch him. Because he called you ladies, and you do anything not to be him. He's saying this is about me and ladies. When you asked him what happened to his face, he said, and I hear I'm quoting again, you did this. He meant that it, 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 it was my you fault. You almost he... killed him. Shut the f*** up. Shut the f*** up. Hold on now. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. They, hold on. Old boy said you did this. They're lying. They have, they're lying. They're lying. They're lying. They, they, they've got to be lying. Cause they saying he never had a partner. But the Incredible Hulk gave him a cigarette, got off the ferry with him, helped him lay down. The Incredible Hulk also carried that one dude back to the infirmary and he disappeared. He did disappear though while he was talking to the old old boy in himself. Did he interact with me first? Yeah, he got a glass of water. He got the glass of water. He got the glass of water. So he's lying because he, he got the glass of water. Yeah. So he had a partner because he had a glass of water. They're lying. Is that the only direct interaction he had with anybody else besides him the gun? They're lying. Because he got the papers from the Hulk. They're lying to you, bro. They're lying. Mm hmm We don't trust him and we don't trust the Hulk. Well, I guess we should have trusted the Hulk because they got the Hulk. Then the old crazy woman told you to run. Yeah, he's lying. We don't trust the Mandarin. We don't trust you. It's been decided that unless we can bring you back to sanity now, permanent measures will be taken to ensure you can't hurt anyone ever again. You have to f*** up. They'll lobotomize you, Andrew. Do you understand? Hey, bro, they lying to you, bro. They just trying to get you. But what about my partner? You, you're going to tell the U.S. Marshal's office that he's a defense mechanism? Shut the f*** up. Hello, boss. Is he in on it? I told you we didn't trust Chuck. You, you working for him? Someone had to stick with you, keep you safe. You mean watch me, huh? Watch me every minute. Don't you recognize me, Andrew? I've been your primary psychiatrist for the last two years. I'm Lester Sheehan. Shut the f*** up. I swore before the Board of Overseers that I could construct the most radical, cutting-edge role-play ever attempted in psychiatry, and it would bring you back. I thought that if we let you play this out, we could get you to see how, how impossible it is.
Shut the f up. I'm a. Hey, You've had the run of the place for two days. Tell me, where are the Nazi experiments? Yeah, maybe I'm crazy. Come on, come on! Andrew, Andrew! No, no. My name is Edward Daniels! Then blast away, because that's the only way you're ever getting off this island. Andrew, please don't. I was about to say he took them bullets like a champ, didn't he? It's a toy, Andrew. We're telling you the truth. Dolores was insane, manic depressive, suicidal. You moved to that lake house after she purposely set your city apartment on fire. You were oh, then you were lying! Andrew, Andrew! Oh, she wants to set it on fire. Andrew, your children! We never had any children. Your wife drowned them. At the cabin by the lake. Shut the f up! I was wondering why that little girl kept popping up in his fucking mind. Oh, I apologize, little girl. I said that he didn't know you. So sorry, baby. I told you not to come in here. I told you. Oh. Oh, my man is crazy for real. And this bitch got the nerve to be sitting in a swing, swinging. Dolores? Why are you all wet? I missed you. I have, I have, I have jokes running to my mom, but I can't f with them right now because I'm so f***ed up. What's going on? Where are the kids? They're in school. Saturday. School's not in on Saturday. Uh, you see how he grabbed her like that? My school is. What school is it? Oh my god. That's so fing sad, man. <laughs> oh, that's so fing sad. Stand shit, man. I know he has to do something horrible to this bitch. Let's put them at the table, Andrew. We'll try them off. They'll be our living dolls. Bitch, you better get away from me before I kill you. Tomorrow we could take them on a picnic. I'm gonna choke you with the strength of God. Please stop. I don't be no baby. Oh my god, it be no baby. I wouldn't call her baby for nothing. Like oh no, we're not shooting her. No, that's too easy. No, no, no. We're choking that bitch. You know, have you seen Harry Potter? You know when the Dementors get you and that last breath leaves? That's what we're doing. Bitch, I want to feel you die. Andrew. <laughs> Andrew, can you hear me? Oh, he passed out. Rachel. Shut the f up. She's a nurse. Why are you here? Because I killed my wife. And why did you do that? She killed my kids. Because she murdered our children. Hey. She told me to let her go. Am I wrong for that? She tried to kill herself the first time. She had an insect living inside her brain, clicking across her skull, just pulling the wires just for fun. Oh. She told me that men listen. Yeah, this is on you, Nia. This is your fault. Here's my fear, Andrew. We, we broke through once before, nine months ago, and then you regressed. I need to know you've accepted reality. Nah, dog. Can I go back to this not knowing? 
because I'm like, are y'all gonna let me out? <laughs> like, y'all let me out, you know what I'm saying? I'll say whatever you want me to say. He tried to help me when no one else would. My name's Andrew Latus, and I murdered my wife in the spring of 52. And shut the f up, man. How we doing this morning? Good. And he in that he in prison, great, right, ain't he? So what's our next move? You tell me. Got to get off this rock, Chuck. Get back to the mainland. Whatever the hell's going on here, it's bad. Shut the f up. Shut the f up. He went right back. This place makes me wonder. Yeah, what's that, boss? I'm about to make him a zombie. Which would be worse? To live as a monster or to die as a good man? Teddy? Shut the f up. He, he did his plan? Is he just playing? Motherfucker. I'm over here all fucked up. The possibility of the Hulk being the other doctor never even crossed my mind. Not even once. But it makes sense because he took... He helped old boy go back. I was convinced they was lying. Because they was like, <laughs> you had no partner. What you talking about? <laughs> it was somebody right here in the whole fucking movie. What the fuck you talking about? And then my dude just started having hallucinations. Like, old girl in the cave. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, then old dude in the cell. Like, the shit they were saying just lined up so good together. And then old girl told him to run. Well, she ain't tell him. She wrote it. You know what I'm saying? But, you know what I'm saying? Run. Man, that shit's crazy, man. Like, I'm trying to talk about, I'm just so body fucked right now. Like, I'm so fucked up. Like, man. It's like, my brain oozing out my ears. I ain't feel like this is the usual suspect. I'm going to have to watch this again. But yeah, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to get on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm putting in shorter hours and just see if there's anything pointing to stuff that I should have caught. Then I'm going to go back and watch it. <laughs> like, here he comes. He's on the way. <laughs> I, I hurry up. I'm going to get off here. But I absolutely love this movie. It's fucked me up. And I'm gonna get answers. I hope y'all enjoyed watching this with me. I enjoyed watching with y'all. If um you didn't do it for me earlier, please like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to check out the Patreon. Speaking of Patreon, we get shout out to Leslie, Trey, John Harold, Becky June, the beautiful dog Missy, Big Al Robin, Big Frank Crow Crow, Cody Sotomayor, Paul Sawicki, Frost 1997, Anna Rondo, Jeff Jerkin. Adam, Grady B. Olsen, Red Tail Z, TJ Gingler, Thomas, the Brandons, Derek, Elizabeth Esposito, 
Nicholas Jenkins, Super Nobody, Rachel Martinez, Jennifer Natley, BB98, Chris, Nareen, Nick, Cope Movies at Midnight, Jamie Gibson, Miguel Brooks, Caleb, Steve McCluzo, Echo, Peanut, Sammy Zachary, John Patrick, Ryan, Rocket, Beardo, Blackbeard, Bob, Hot Indie Media, Amen Lot, Jake Stimson, Benign Boar, Jake Flogging, Tony A. Ergon, Captain Roberts, Dom, LeVar Hawkins, Show, Colin LaShore, Jason, Holly Smith, Brad Williams, Rick, Miranda, Michael Clark, Jesse, Gina, Luke the First, Antoine, and Cecil. Thank all y'all for being VIPs. I want to thank everybody else for being part of this family as well. I'm going to get off here. But y'all be good. Y'all be safe. Night, night.